Hello everybody, this is Xenotet H3543, welcome you back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV The After Years. Um, I think I'm going to settle on this party for the time being. We will see. Uh, there are reasons to take other people along, but I think uh, based on some of the events, well, there are some interesting event things that are coming up. Oh, goodness, I don't know. Gosh. I think we'll stick with this for now. I'm not... I'm not thrilled about things, but... We're gonna stick with this party for now. I'm actually having a little tempted to swap Golbez for Yon, but that's it. I mean, this party mostly is just because I can kind of just roll with them, and they're basically just ready to go. Like, they're already decked out. I do actually want a better staff. You have a staff, I think. That'll work better. And we've got a couple of bands in this party. I think I'm going to like this party. Uh, just so you, as a note, you can rest in the beds here. Yes. Okay, so I don't have to use any of my camping gear to do anything at the save point. The save point is just a save point. We're going to leave all these people behind. We'll be able to swap party members later, hopefully. Head outside. Uh, there's nothing here on the lunar surface other than this entrance here. The rest of this is all just kind of a maze of stuff that you can explore, but there's nothing of note. Anyway, uh, let's yeah, maybe turn the game sound down a little bit. Uh, we are looking for a specific enemy formation here on the waning moon. Yeah, there's nothing down here. And I'm going to keep running away from things until I find it. Uh, this party's also just generally pretty strong right now, you know, having had them for a while. I will bring some other people along it now and then, but we're going to primarily be sticking with this party. Anyway, this is the fight I was looking for. You're going to blast her, which is really rude. We're going to do that. Raise. Get him back up. We'll take a swipe with Kane. Doesn't really matter if everyone gets the experience, but I would like some people to get the experience from this Grey Curl. This is a different Grey Curl than the other Grey Curl we saw. It has a different bestiary entry. No! Okay, hold is less bad. Hold is much less bad than what it was doing before. Than death. I can live with hold a little bit. Rip edge. That's why I was doing a phoenix- that's why I was doing a Kira. Okay. Uh, you can't kill Rosa, though. That's not okay. You really can't kill Rosa. You're pretty slow, though, I think. Because these are all feeling like counterattacks. Uh, Edge is... That's annoying. Uh, we'll, we'll be fine, though. Golbez and Rydia can take turns now, so I'm less concerned. Still concerned, but uh, less concerned.
Nice. Everyone was alive. Yeah, we're gonna have to rest up after that, but that's okay. The reason we did that was to get this bestiary entry here. We scroll all the way down here. Grey Curl 2. They can drop the Grey Curl Tails, unlike the Grey Curl 3s. A lot more health. I am not going to farm them for Grey Tails, though. That sounds like not fun. Let's go rest. So many people on our airship. It's a little silly. Uh, New Moon should be fine. I mean, White Magic Down is not ideal, but it's not a worst. Ninja Up is good, actually, because that's jump. That affects the jump command and the... And ninjutsu, which is not bad. I'm just gonna double check. There's nothing up up here. Don't hit my mages. Okay, you don't hit that hard anyway. I don't think there's anything up here, but we're gonna go looking for stuff. I'm gonna turn on auto battle. That hurt a little bit. Because a lot of these fights can just be auto-battled to death. What was the point of this staircase? Like, there's no point. Is this all just, like, a really long dead end? It might be. I'm gonna run away, because I don't want to deal with the Grey Curl. It has instant death attacks, and I don't like instant death attacks. Yeah, there's no point. Okay. Confirmed useless path that you can walk down for no reason. Other than to get encounters. I suppose you can get encounters. That's a thing. Let's not. I'm gonna keep running away from things. I don't really care about losing my gill. I've got so much. I want to get into the subterrane. There's a bunch of new things in the subterrain. Let's head in. We're in the subterrain. Is this the same... Okay, this looks like the same layout as the lunar other lunar subterrain. Now, we do have to take on this group because there's a new enemy here. The eukaryote in the back is new. I'm gonna leave it. I'm not gonna auto battle this because, uh. I don't feel like that's necessary. Lydia has so much MP that I really don't feel any worry about using Sylph on everything. She can cast it so many times, and that'll just take care of a lot of our healing, too. Okay. I'm glad I don't have to learn new maps. Um, decoy. Oh, Prokaryote is new. Um, we want to attack it. Golbez, you can do something to the Black Flam. Actually, you've got Quake. Do Quake. Thanks, Golbez. So, Rose is a little underleveled, which is a little annoying, but we'll make do with it. Otherwise, I'm taking my kind of highest level party members and just rolling with them. I mean, these party members are very good. These are new care enemies! Hello, new enemies. Pretty sure High Wizard is a mage. Amazon is gone. We're gonna steal some HP from the High Wizard. The Sylphs are pretty good, so I don't mind using them. I 
Let's just parry through your turn. Doesn't matter. Rest in peace, High Wizard. Uh, we get new beastery entries. Should be mentioned. Uh, we've got a few, actually. Uh, you carry out here. These were on the other moon. Like the original moon. Same with prokaryotes. We've seen them before. In Final Fantasy IV, not in After Years, though. And scrolling through all this stuff, if we go down here... Hi, wizards! New enemy. They're not very strong. Amazons! Oh, you can drop lustrous swords. That's cool. Yeah, okay, whatever. Uh, we're gonna check out this path, because I think this path is going to be not the way forward. We have moved further down, but pretty much the enemy table is the same for the first... Well, yeah, for the first few floors, it's basically the same. Yay, a cottage. Uh, let's use... What are they weak to, I think? Let's just use Blast. Edge. Yeah, Edge Ninjutsu. Just destroy everything. There's nothing in that secret passage, I don't think. Just... Yeah. We can auto-battle them to death easily. Do I have... Hold on. You have the rare band equipped. Okay, that's actually good. I do like having the rare band equipped. These enemies are pretty easy, so I'm just gonna... Well, I'm not gonna auto-battle with Bridia, because Bridia needs to do some uh, healing. Use the Sylph Summon. I like that the Sylph Summon's at the top of my spell list, basically. Other than Mind Flayer, but, you know. Mind is different. It's a special summon that we're never going to use. But we have it. Because I got lucky and got a rare drop from something. Oh. You need to get healed. I've got to have some antidotes in here, right? Yeah, I've got 50 antidotes. Okay. There's some new stuff out there, I see. But... I will take Genji Shield. Uh, that's gonna be an upgrade for you. Uh, you... have an Aegis Shield, that's gonna be fine. Yeah. Let's just upgrade Kane. I should be warping back, I guess, but... Yeah. Not as high priority. We can just bonk here. I don't really mind. Goodbye, Chimera Brain. Let's not auto-battle here. Rude! I don't like the poison touch that they have. I don't like that. Because that just means I have to go in here and use an antidote so they don't, like, lose a bunch of health to poison because I don't want to lose a bunch of health to poison for no reason. Okay. Continuing along... Bone Dragon Green Variant. We're gonna do some damage to you. Uh, we're gonna use the Sylphs again. I know, so original. Uh, you don't do anything. Yeah, just don't do anything, Rosa. You're here just to be a white mage if I need a white mage, basically. But I'm not gonna need a white mage for random fights. I will probably want one for some of the boss fights down here. That's why Rosa's here. And because I want to level her up. And she has a decent band with Rydia. There's a few reasons. I hate this! Stop! Stop it with the free, uh... Poison applications. Like, I just want Rosa to never get poisoned again. Oh, we found a shattered crystal. 
That's interesting. Uh, we do want to fight this fight. Now uh, the dark grenade is new. We took out the evil dreamer is not. We've seen them before, but the dark grenade is new, so we'll take him on. Get him in the bestiary. That was just to make sure Rose is fine. Bestiary, Dark Grenade, Dark Grenade 1 specifically, but yeah, there they are, they're a thing. Oh, uh, this chest, right, we do this little walk around. Yay, we got a potion! Genji armor, probably gonna be better than that. Yeah, for sure. Uh, no one wants ice armor. Yeah, no, no one wants ice armor. Like, if you don't poison me, I don't hate you. But if you poison me, I get a little salty. Because you shouldn't poison me. I'm gonna keep bonking. I don't know. It's just easier than actually putting strategy into those fights. What's down there? I feel like there's more stuff. I don't know. Ah, uh, there's definitely more stuff here. It's a crystal! Uh, we have, I think, a boss time. Yeah, we got boss time. It's Bygen. He's back. Oh, no. No auto battle. Uh, you do that. Jump on him. You. Uh, your job is to cast Quake. And your job is to summon Sylph on the main one. And we're gonna get, uh, the... We don't need the blinks. We can go for Berserks. We're going to start with Edge, because Edge is the most... the one that needs to get angry the most. Yeah. Self away some HP, please. That's your job. Bygen will cast Reflect on himself. That's fine. I don't care if you cast Reflect. Golbez is quaking to try to do some damage to the arms. Basically. Thank you, Kane. That's a little rude if that hits. Yeah, that hit. That's a little rude. That's fine. Yeah, that's gonna be fine. I don't really need to do much. And just parry. Yeah, rip arms. Bygen will regenerate the arms, because that's what he does. But we have an edge going burr. It still lives. Thank you for telling me. I don't like self-destruct. Yeah, I don't like self-destruct. Because it does that. Uh, but, uh, left arm will take a bunch of damage, which means that it won't be able to do anything. Oh yeah, no, left arm's down. Edge misses out on that experience, which is a little bit of a, a shame. Well. That's that, boss. And now we get a tent. We get a little heal. Oh yeah, uh, Theodore's now in the party, because why not? Also Ursula.
Uh, these are not people I took, but, you know, I'm fine with this. I guess it's implied that we, that everyone's kind of coming along. Which I don't mind. I'm quite happy to take a whole bunch of different people. Aww. I'm sure he'll be fine. Yeah, Cecil will be fine. And we learned the Twin Rush Band. Uh, this band... What is the Twin Rush Band? I assume that's, uh, Theodore and... Oh yeah, but we're back with this party now. Um, I'm gonna explore this floor. Because I want to. Don't steal MP. Ha! Huh. You can't steal MP from Rosa. That's great. I'm gonna explore this floor. Just this floor. This is slightly different, but not really that different. And then we'll go check on that band. Uh, this way. Let's not take this fight. Yeah, let's not take that fight. Can we get into fewer encounters? I don't know, it just feels like I'm getting into a lot of encounters for not very good reason. Oh my goodness, so many encounters. You're not, there's not even new enemies. They're just the same enemies that we've seen before. Don't, don't take Kane's MP. I don't like that. Oh goodness, I really should not have auto-battled there. Uh, this is really, really bad. No, get out. Oh my goodness. Frost Blast is way overpowered on back attacks, and they should never get back attacks, ever. Never give Chimera Brains back attacks. That's just not going to work well. Uh, there's nothing over there. Okay. I'm gonna make sure. Thank you for one-shotting it. Uh, we can actually... Edit party right here. We could go back to the Lunar Whale and heal up, which is an option as well. Um, I want to make sure we've gotten everything here. I think we've seen all of the random enemies. Just double checking. Yeah, I think we've seen all the random enemies. I'm going to double check the beast here real quick. Yeah, yeah, I think we've gotten all the random enemies so far. We have uh, new enemies here. Bygan. The right arm. And the left arm. Okay, there's not going to be any new, more new enemies for a bit. Uh, let's... Uh, edit party. I'm going to bring Theodore in. And Ursula, because I assume they're the ones who just learned the band. Twin Rush! Did I already show Twin Rush off? I don't think I did. No, don't auto battle. Let's show Twin Rush off. Yay! Uh. 
Give me back Edge. Give me back Golbez. Gosh, we have so many party members. Like, I think I'm fine to switch in most of these other people. Like, the level 40 people are fine. I don't think Kalka and Brina are ever coming along, ever, because they're just too weak. They would just die. They would die instantly. I don't feel like fighting. Actually, I'm going to go back to the Lunar Wayla heal up. And I think that's actually... We, we took on Baigan. I think that's a pretty good time to end the part off. I want the free heal. Well, free-ish heal. Not Beast Jerry. I wanted, we are two-thirds of the way through the Beast Jerry, though. I want a different moon phase, phase in the moon, I think. Oh, there's so many people. Let's go to Waxing Moon. Oh, the next boss actually... Well, yeah, we'll be able to... For the next boss, we definitely want uh, this Mage Masher equipped. I'm just trying to think what else I want equipped. Aegis Shield is very good. Like that. You're probably fine. Everyone else is probably fine. Doing some planning. Uh, but yeah, that's going to do it for this part. We made it to the first sort of stopping point in the Lunar Whale. Basement 3. And next time we will continue to dive down the lunar, sub lunar subterrain, excuse me. I'll see you then.